Right. Oh, yeah, those are my car keys. I dropped them. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Hey there, little brothers, big brother here. I told myself I was going to start doing a new opening, but I didn't do it. So we're just going to go with that. Next time. Next time. Here with Psycho Dad. He, he was a little upset that I didn't introduce him within the first 30 seconds. So, you know, that's how it goes. Yeah. It really <laughs> so, upsets me. Yeah. Friday night, we're here hanging out at the old Juggy store. You can see the t-shirts back there. This is where everybody, like, hand sews everything. Every nook and cranny of the t-shirt. Every thread and spit in that t-shirt. Yeah, we don't ship it out to other countries that have done. No, we do not do that. It everything is 100% American made. Ex except for all the illegals that work underneath Uncle Larry and my mom well, we and my aunt. But we don't talk about that. Right. No, we can't talk about that. No. No. Just kidding, guys. We, that's not a real thing. Don't, don't, yeah, don't worry about that. But anyway, we're going to get back at Uncle Larry tonight. Uh, as you guys know, he put a, a car whistle in my tailpipe, my charger, and then he put a very embarrassing magnet on the side of his Tahoe, yep. which this guy does not look like a guy that jerks off behind the wheel. No, I'm too no, serious. No, he's for too that. serious for that. There. Yeah, I mean, maybe. Yeah. So, what All we're right. gonna do is, we're gonna call him from a restricted number, Uncle Larry, that is, not, not, not my dad. Um, he's gonna call, though. He's gonna call from a restricted number and get Uncle Larry over here, because we're gonna turn the lights on as one light's already on. Um, maybe two. Wow. They've got a lot of lights in here. And then we're gonna turn on some equipment. And he's going to pretend to be, I don't know, somebody. I'll come up with a good neighbor uh, voice or something and we can come up with and get him out here. Or try to get him out here. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, he's not doing anything. He could be drunk in a corner. I don't know that. Yeah, he could be drugged in right. a corner yeah. bar. You never know. You never know. But we're going to try and get him out here. And then from there, you'll, you'll see. You'll see. So, um, I don't know if you want to give him a call now. You can call from restricted numbers, right? Yep. All right, cool. So we're gonna actually, this is this place is like absolute dead zone. I'm like, let me give you guys an idea. Like, yeah, it says no service. So we got nothing, we have to go outside to do this, unfortunately. And it's cold as shit, it got like 20 degree weather like all weekend. We're not used to that, but yeah, so we're gonna get them here and from there, I'll let you guys know. Are you ready to go? I'll give it a shot. All right, should we meander out the exit door? We'll see how the signal is. So far, 3G now. Just like pop this up. <clears throat> oh, beautiful night. Hello, Mr. Abraham. Hey, this is John uh, from Spruce Street, right up from the shop. Remember, I uh, got a couple covers from you uh, about two months ago for my boat. And it, well, I, I, my family and I were going to the mall, and we rode through your parking lot, and uh, the lights were on. So I, 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 I got out of my vehicle and went to the door. It is locked, but there's machinery running, and the lights are on. I was kind of, you know, uh, taken aback by that. No, sir, there was nobody there, and, uh, you know, I was, you know, it was kind of weird because everything was left on in there, and, and, and you know, I, I didn't want to call the police, but I figure I'd call you first just in case because the doors are locked, so. Okay. Not a problem. I just, I, I was worried. I, I didn't want, you know, anything to happen, okay? Okay. All right. All right. God bless and have a great night. Success. Thank you. Bye bye. Success. Wait, the phone's ringing in here. Wait, where's the phone even at? One right there. Oh, this. I don't even have a dial tone. Done? Nah, it just beeps. <laughs> so he said. He's oh, it's not even plugged in. Oh, that explains it. Okay. So he said he's coming? He said he's coming. All right, cool. All right, so little brothers, basically what's going to happen here is Uncle Larry's going to do one of two things when he gets here. He's going to turn off his car and bring his keys inside, or he's going to leave his car running. So what we're going to do is I'm going to be hiding back in here just to kind of like see Uncle Larry. Like, I don't even know what he's going to be doing. He's, I mean, is he going to be mad? I don't even know. I mean, it's Friday night. I'd imagine he might be able to... Oh, my nose is so red. 
Oh, it's so chilly. He might be pissed. Yeah, he might be. Um, so if he comes inside with his keys, my dad's going to be hiding around the corner outside and he's going to hop in his car. And if the keys are with him, which I hope you should be able to see out there, right? I should be able to see, I hope. It's okay. pitch black out there, though. All right. Uh, so if his keys are with him, my dad's going to hide in the back seat. And then when Uncle I leave, he's going to scare the shit out of him. Um, if he brings his, if he leaves his keys in this car, you're going to bring the car back to this carport. <laughs> and we're going to lock it inside. And then from there, I'm going to jump in the back seat. And then you're gonna have to like jump out and like spook him or something. All right. But we'll wait yeah. as we always do. Yeah, we do everything on the fly. Hey, I do have a GoPro. Oh, oh, GoPro's right there in her mind. I do have a GoPro, so he's gonna have that on him. Just in case. Really? The phone's ringing again. That's a couple. Wait, where the hell's that? Wait, can I I'm gonna answer it. Hello, Wayne J. Canvas. You have reached Wayne J. Canvas. We can only answer the phone right now. If you are calling with any questions pertaining to Monday Night Phone, will that please, please contact me? I don't think I hit line two. Yeah, well, they didn't, they didn't say word when I answered. Fuck. Damn, I thought that would have been kind of fun. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're going to get everything set up and shishurated so that when Uncle Larry does get here. It's all set. Uh, it's like 15 minute drive. Yeah. 10, 15, 15 yeah, minutes. Sure this guy, this man wears shorts. Oh. Really? Got it. Did you get it? Hello, AJ Canvas. Did they talk? No, they didn't say anything. <laughs> Like there's somebody there too. Chicken shit. Motherfuckers. <sighs> Alright little brothers. Heat sealer's on. My dad just went outside. He's gonna be waiting for Uncle Larry to pull in so he can do his thing. Heat sealer's actually pretty loud. I erected a little fort of boxes to hide behind. <laughs> this is so stupid, but I love it. <laughs> Uh, I used to work here when I was a kid. <laughs> All right, let's see. I'm probably gonna have to cut this. My little dinky fort, my little box fort. This place is dirty as shit. Oh my god. Oh shit!
the back of it. Everything. I'll lock this door and I'll lock the insurance and I'll lock the other door. Alright? Yeah, make sure you turn the, the metro, Phil. Yeah. Make sure you turn the lights off. I'll get it ready. Alright. Alright. Man, you guys are killing me! <laughs> so this was this was a prank you and your dad pulled on me? Damn! You just about killed me. <laughs> oh, oh man! Where did your dad park at? I uh, parked on the other side of the building. I see. <laughs> oh, Jesus. You guys are killing me, man. <laughs> well, that's what you get when you put something in my tailpipe. <laughs> what do you mean I put something in your tailpipe? That was all Tom. All Tom? Huh. No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. I watched the video. Oh, I skimmed through it, but. Yeah, it was me. Yeah, I was going to say. I did cut out at the part where it was actually put in, so. No, yeah, you. Yeah. You, Tom was on it too. So you still. guys, how'd you get your dad to do this? <laughs> uh, he was just properly motivated is all. <laughs> Did you, cool. And I had, a, I had put a GoPro up there. You had a camera in here too? Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Wow, I'm surprised this thing actually, I'm surprised he was actually able to put it on. Oh, he's never used one of these before. He got him. Scared shit out of me? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. Well, you're right. <laughs> I can't believe you did it. Do what? Call me out here for this shit. What else were you doing? Yeah. Taking, you know, nap, maybe? Yeah. Were you in your uh, lounging pants for you? This <laughs> <laughs> phone won't stop ringing. Yeah, your phone won't stop ringing. Yeah. It, that's how Big it is. Big water's coming time. in. No, that's how it is all the time. Is it? Yeah. Larry fans? No. No? No, they don't. Most people don't even leave a message. Did you guys lock everything? That, yeah, we unlocked everything lock. first, but yeah. That's locked. Double check it. All right. What? Tagged him back.
Why? All right, guys, don't forget to subscribe for more content. Twitter, Instagram, Twitch links in the description. Follow me on Snapchat, Chef2000. Yeah. That's what happens. Was it locked? Yeah. Uh -huh. Just think, if those fans had called and, and wanted to talk <laughs> on the phone, they would have talked to us. All right. I just closed off the video, Dad. What do you have to say? Don't forget. Talk to Big Brother. No, no, <laughs> we're, we're doing the keep it rigid thing. Why keep it rigid? Why? Why not? We're, okay. we, we can yeah. all we can say that. Oh, okay. I didn't know if it it's was not Jesse's thing only. Copyrighted on us. No, we're Ridgeways. We can say whatever right, we want. That's right. Ridgeways, say whatever we want. Okay, keep it, cool. Keep it rigid or frigid, because yeah, it's it is cold in like what below twenties today. Yeah. yeah. All right. Keep it frigid.